Shesky. Hmm. Assalamu alaikum. Good morning, my dear friends. Hmm. I'm gonna start my seminar with some quotes which is related to my topic. So the human brain is an incredible pattern matching machine. So well, I am Kalis Fatima Liu and and I'm studying in 10th standard A section in Anjum English Medium High School. So let's start our let's move to our topic. First of all, we will study about the table of contents, and in this we will study about the introduction to human brain, parts of the brain, fore brain, mid brain, hind brain, and conclusion. And there you can see the schematic diagram of the brain with labeled parts. Next, we will move to study about the brain, the human brain. So first of all, we will study about the introduction of human brain. So this organ allows us to think, move, feel, taste, and smell, etc. And it controls our body, receives or analyzes and stores information. For example, when a message comes into the brain, anywhere from anywhere in the body, the brain tells the body how to react. For example, imagine this is a hot stuff, and if you touch a hot stuff, the nerves in your skin. will shoot a message of pain to your brain the brain then sends a message back telling the muscles in your hand to pull away so this work has done by the brain so next we will move to the topic the human brain so here human brain is the central organ of the human nervous system and with the spinal cord which makes up the central nervous system next point each part of the brain is responsible for the controlling different body functions the brain is contained in and protected by the skull bones of the head on an average an adult brain weighs between 1.0 kg to 1.5 kg next we will move to study about the parts of the brain Here, human brain is mainly divided into three main parts on the basis of their of their functions and placement. Next, the three main parts of the human brain are fore brain, mid brain, hind brain, and this is called fore brain, and this is called hind brain, and this is this part is called mid brain. Next, we will move to study about. the fore brain which is the first part and the largest part of the brain and it is the anterior part of the brain which means it is located in front of our brain next the fore brain parts include cerebrum hypothalamus and thalamus next it fun it function is fore brain function is it controls the reproductive functions body temperature and emotions hunger sleep and memory and intelligence there is one fact about this fore brain the largest among the fore brain parts is cerebrum so it is also the largest part of our brain cerebrum is the largest part of our brain next we will move next you as you can see here this is a human human brain and this part is called cerebrum this whole part is called cerebrum and this is called thalamus and this is called hypothalamus and this is situated at the back side of the brain and the hind brain is mainly composed of cerebellum medulla and pons next hind brain function is the three regions of the hind brain coordinate all processes which are necessary for the survival next we will move on the here you can see the hind brain structure this region is called pons and this is medulla and this is called spinal cord and this is cerebellum next we will we will continue the topic so here the human brain controls nearly every aspect of the human body ranging from physiological functions to co to cognitive abilities and it functions by receiving and sending signals to be on neurons to different parts of the body and the human brain is mainly composed of neurons which is the fundamental unit of brain and neuron nervous 
system. Thank you for listening my class. Thank you for your time. And as we all know on YouTube, uh, if you want to more, if you want to know more about our school, then do subscribe, like, and share your channel.